Some of the most memorable moments in recent TV history weren't even planned, but were instead born from inspired, improvised moments between gifted actors. They may have felt too perfectly placed to be off the cuff, but here are a few genuinely unscripted exchanges that took viewers and producers totally by surprise. And we're not making this one up on the spot, there are definite spoilers ahead. Stormborn Smooch Game of Thrones is a very expensive, obsessively examined show, so it makes sense to assume every moment must be scripted to the letter. However, as it turns out, there's some room for flexibility on the series. In the Season 7 episode, Stormborn, Yara Greyjoy and Ilaria Sand get to know each other a little better, before being interrupted by an attack. Seems like you don't need a protector. Actress Gemma Whelan, who plays Yara, revealed after the episode aired that the kiss wasn't scripted, saying that it, quote, just seemed like something we should do. Moira Knows Best Many fans were left heartbroken when Oliver's mother Moira bit the dust on the CW's arrow. Moira sacrificed her life for her children, and moments before getting a sword through the chest, she pleaded with her daughter to look away. Thea, I love you. <laughs> Close your eyes, baby! No! Actress Susanna Thompson later revealed that plea was actually improvised. She came up with the close your eyes comment as a way to bridge the gap between Moira telling Slade to let her children live and her actual death. Executive producer Mark Guggenheim ended up loving the line, so it made the final cut. Poppins Improv Happy Endings was a joke machine in its three seasons on ABC. With a naturally hilarious cast, it makes sense some of those jokes would be improvised including a small but fun moment featuring a Mary Poppins reference from Jane, played by Eliza Coop. Why is it so freezing in here? I don't know, why don't you ask Tuppence a bag? Coop was referencing her husband, played by Damon Wayans Jr., whose cologne attracts pigeons. The actress was surprised to see that people on Twitter noticed and appreciated the relatively obscure joke, which is a reference to the Feed the Birds scene in the Disney classic. Feed the birds. Tuppence a bag. Off on the right foot Arthur was never a great friend to Merlin while starring on the character's namesake BBC One series, but the two did have fun messing with each other on the show, just as the actors did behind the scenes. According to actor Bradley James, the scene in which his Arthur rubs his foot on Merlin's face in season one after a sweet bonding conversation was actually just him messing with actor Colin Morgan, but it ended up making it into the final cut. James revealed on the DVD commentary that that was his favorite bit of the episode, but that he didn't do it in rehearsals. Crybaby There were a lot of heartbreaking moments in Breaking Bad over the years, but one of the biggest tearjerkers came when Walt's baby daughter Holly started calling out for her mother after her father abducted her. Won't that be nice, Holly? No, mama. No, mama. Mama. But that's not how the scene was planned. During the bathroom scene, the little actress saw her real mother just a few feet away and ended up calling out to her. Credit goes to actor Brian Cranston for rolling with it, because the moment ended up being an instant classic. Fruit of his labor Even if you only watch Psych intermittently, you know how important pineapples were to the show. As it turns out, the whole thing started thanks to an improvisation from Psych star James Roday. Ooh! Should I slice this up for the road? Rode was so enthusiastic about the joke that the producers felt like he just had to keep it in, and it spiraled out from there. One of the tropical fruits appeared in almost every episode of the series, in addition to featuring prominently in its marketing over the years. Thanks for watching. Click the looper icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.